Hey guys, you're watching 31 Account. I'm Eric Lee, and if you've been keeping up with my fitness, you know, my fitness journey on Instagram, you'll see why I'm all sweaty and stuff. I've been doing 45 minutes of cardio every morning, trying to get fit, yeah baby, trying to get good and sexy. But this video is not about the getting dirty, it's about getting clean. Stay tuned. So if you're not familiar with the brand Dr. Squatch, uh, like Sasquatch is pretty cool. They have these amazing commercials or uh, little ads that you see on Instagram and they've been really building up momentum and it really piqued my interest. So I was like, hey, I just want to try it out. You know, they didn't pay me, they didn't reach out to me, nothing. I just wanted to try it out. It was just amazing, uh, just marketing period and had to try it out. I'm gonna roll one of these clips right now. Listen up, the soap you shower with, it's You probably haven't even questioned what bar of soap you lather up with. Let's face it, most guys don't. They're still using whatever bar their mommy bought for her little man. Is that what you want? To smell like mama's little man? Ugh. But now you can upgrade your shower game with Dr. Squatch Natural Soap. I'm talking about natural, nourishing, cold-pressed, hand-cut soap for men. Men who use their hands. Men who build things. Men who open the pickle jar on the first try. Men who catch foul balls without spilling their beer. You won't just smell good either. Your skin will be healthier and more nourished. Dare I say, soft. Oh, men aren't supposed to have soft skin? Yeah, well men weren't supposed to cry during movies. And then they made the movie Rudy. So yeah, that was it. Yeah, I know, right? Amazing, smart people, very smart when it comes to the marketing. Uh, I'm going to show you what I ordered and uh, how it came packaged. I already cut it open so you can see. I have not pulled it out yet. But as you can see, this is uh, to the Lee family. This is where it came from. Yes, sir. And uh, let's get to pulling this stuff out. Looks like I cut a little deep, but this is just shipping information. And let's see how this is packaged. Okay, so as you can see there, little brand, it's actually pretty dang on nice. Nautical Sage. Yes, sir. Let me get a little sniff of this real quick. I'm going to flip this camera. Yeah. Oh, my God. This smells really good. Keith's taking a test right now. Uh, I want her to smell it. But she picked it out, like the scent, because I'm really a hands-on type person. So you could be like, oh, lavender this or that. And I just, to me, I, I can't picture it. I'm really about grabbing something and putting my hands on it, sniffing it in person. But, you know, uh, based off the commercials and all the reviews so far, you really couldn't go wrong with any of them. I can't stop sniffing this. It smells good. All right. Uh, there's a few other things that we're going to test out with this review is how well it lathers. So yeah, you're gonna be able to see a little bit more in my shoulders <laughs> a little later, see if it lathers up really good. And uh, obviously it's already winning with the smell, but we'll see how it smells, you know, once we start showering up. So bear with me. I'm gonna let Keith smells it, uh, smell it in a second, but she's taking the test right now. So I'll be back for you guys. All right guys, so Keith just finished taking her test. Now it's time to check out the packaging and uh, give her a little sniff, sniff, see what she thinks about this Dr. Squash. Mmm, this smells really good. It smells better than I thought it would. Um, that nautical sage, I don't really smell anything that smells like ocean, but the sage, the sage smells really, really good. What do you think about the packaging? Um, I like that it's in cardboard. It's very um, environmentally friendly. I just like the mascot. It looks so cool. Like, Yeah, I think it's a beautiful packaging. You just get your little sniff from there. Kind of looks like beef squash from Bob's Burgers. <laughs> I know, that's the first thing I thought. Okay, and as you can see right here, there's a little story on the back. You guys can read that on your own. I'm going to try to, well, I'm going to give it to Keith so she can crack it open. Open it from this side. And there's a simple block of soap. All right, so it has some texture to it. Uh, you can see it's a little grainy, so it looks all natural. Not like it's pressed or anything like that. Kind of looks looks hand cut, you know. I'm not an expert, but it feels soft. So the big test is. Let me switch this over. All right, you guys can see me. So the big test is going to be how it lathers because that's 
when it, ooh. Uh, I couldn't smell, I guess I couldn't smell it through the box. Not like I can smell it now. Damn, it smells good. Excuse my French, guys. So, I'm gonna take it into the shower, see what this thing does, cause like I said, I've been doing that cardio. I'm a little sweaty, a little stinky. Key can bear being by me, like barely. But we finna see how it lathers up. So, here we go. All right, guys, so I'm in the shower. You can see, I'm finna use this, uh, this soap real quick and see how well it lathers. Right now, all I do is rinse off the sweat. Here we go. Oh, immediately it's like, yeah, it's, well, it feels really good. Like my skin already, as you can see in the video, you can see how everything like more glossy feeling. I'm actually gonna turn this water off just so I'm not rinsing off all the extra soap that's coming out. And as you, dang. Yeah, as soon as I turned the water off, that's what the problem was. It's, uh, I gotta stop. It's literally started lathering up way too much already. <laughs> But if you guys can see right there, all this, this is like from a few strokes. I turned the water off, so yeah, I'm gonna rinse this stuff off. But as you can see, it's doing exactly what it says. My hands are super lathery. And I guess if I was a little more hairier, there'd be even more soap. But I am like drizzed in it from the two seconds. And I'm not, I don't, oh, this smells really good. It gets a little bit more tame, the smell, once you get in the shower and, uh, yeah, but it's, oh man. Kiki, can you smell it? What smells you really good. So guys, based off of everything we went over, the packaging, the scent, the, the even the time of delivery, it only took us a week, or under a week to get it. Uh, the lathering, this gets two thumbs ups from 31 and counting. Like I said, the description for the product will be down below, and you guys enjoy. You watching 31 Account, I'm Eric Lee, and we out.